Hello and welcome to day three of the 21 day new me challenge. Today we're going to start by warming up our bodies in a way that we might do for a sports match with football, netball, hockey, rugby, whatever it is that you know. So come to a standing position and just gently start to roll the head and neck. Just waking up your body. Saying good morning if it's the morning for you. Good afternoon. Well, good night. And simply notice as you roll where there is kind of tension or where there's more stiffness. And as you do that, rhyme your movement with your breath, just like you might in yin yoga. Which simply means joining your movement with your breath in any way that feels like it matches that dance. Moving down to the shoulders, the arms, the wrists, even the fingers. So just lubricating each joint. And taking this moment to be with yourself. Saying hello to yourself, to your body. Moving your torso in circles as if you're moving it around a pole opening it up the hands behind your back and stretching your shoulders back and just feel into your body feel what feels good what I'm suggesting here is merely an invitation, but your body knows best. Your body knows where the edges are. Stretching out to the side if you wanna join me. Your body knows what's needed. Just like a cat or a dog might stretch after waking up from a nap. I'm now just bending over gently, elongating my back and gently pulling my shoulders forward one by one. Gently rolling back up, not by moving your muscles, but by pushing your hips forward ever so slightly, more and more forward. As your hips come forward, you notice this is a natural roll of your spine without the use of your back muscles. And wiggling your hips. Oh. During this moment to appreciate your body. Oh, so much of the time we are thinking of the body as our vehicle or taking it for granted. And this is the opportunity to say thank you without you. I wouldn't be here. And then shaking off the legs a little bit. And doing any kind of shaking, movement, stretching. Now that allows you to just come into more alignment. I'm going to go to downward dog. Ah. What you're doing here as well is you're stretching the fascia, which is this beautiful cobweb-like structure in between our muscles and our skin. And it is a connective tissue that joins up our nervous system. Really, really important. So what we're doing here as well is we're literally waking up the body, we're activating the body, telling it we're ready for a new day and that we're ready to begin with intention. So now, as you find your way back to a seated position or even stillness and standing, you can close your eyes and take three really generous breaths. Give this oxygen to you, to your body, to your mind, in through the nose, taking those 
beautiful sips at the top and then fully out, something like this. grown sighs or yawns that might be there for you <sighs> shaking it out a little bit <laughs> and coming into stillness resting your body resting your mind in an upright and attentive posture Normally we would go about our day as we often do. Same old patterns of behavior, habits, same old way of thinking and feeling. Maybe it's just another day, maybe you're expecting an argument with your boss or with your partner or trouble with kids. But I invite you now to Create a new expectation. What would you love to expect about your day? What would you love to expect in the interactions you have with people? And most importantly, what do you expect from yourself? In this moment, we're creating that new possibility, a new thought, a new energetic openness. By the end of these 21 days, we want to come to expect that we act in a way that feels aligned. We want to come to expect that life is joyful and magical and generous in the ways that we want it to be. What if the universe was a really friendly place and only gives you what it is that you need for your own self-liberation, your own growth? this mean for your situation? How would you feel if that was true? So I'm just playing a game, just taking a moment to wear that jacket again of what if all of my life right now and exactly the way it is is exactly how it should be this is the perfect timing this is absolutely perfect for your growth and for you to step into this new person that you feel is emerging from you oh What a lovely feeling to welcome in life in that way. Notice all the ways in which life is exactly working for you. You wanted to be a better partner or a friend, colleague, lover, sibling, mother, father. And this is your opportunity. This is your chance to step into that expansion. Isn't that lovely of life to give you that? <laughs> Take a moment here to be grateful for this opportunity. To actually give thanks genuinely for the ways in which life is offering you something.
is giving you exactly what you need right now. Join me in placing one hand on your heart space to do so. Thank you, life. Thank you, universe, for giving me not necessarily what I want, but exactly what I need in every moment. What if the timing of the things that are happening in my life are absolutely perfect, just as it's supposed to happen? with this fresh expectation, this fresh thought and approach to your day. Finally notice, what do you expect yourself to do from a place of trust? Trust that you will express the person that you know you are deep down. trusting that part of you that brings you here to this challenge that wants to be expressed and wants to emerge from you. Let your mind give you one thing that you could do today that is an expression of that person within you. How is it you're going about your day? What is it you're doing from a place of pure consciousness, deciding, choosing for yourself how and who you are. Take a really nice big deep breath into that energy, into the expectation. know that and expect that today is going to be a wonderful day. It's a day that will bring you exactly what you want. And if there are things that you didn't expect or that aren't aligned with that expectation, know that life is giving you exactly what you need. You just didn't know it. Have a beautiful day and we'll see you tomorrow for day four.